thought that um, this was going to be a really big challenge for us, and it was, uh, because of the intensity that Florida State plays with. And they stay at that intensity level. Hopefully, we learn something uh, from it. But um, I thought this going into the game. I watched, I watched them on video, and I said, oh my gosh, this is a team that plays incredibly hard, and they are able to sustain that effort for the duration. Uh, everybody that comes in is going as hard as they possibly can. And, you know, our, our guys have to learn how to do that. So we had stretches today, um, and that's been uh, an issue for us is having uh, stretches and not having it as uh, something you, you do all the time. Question. Really, in both the first and second half, probably about halfway through, you're right there with them. In the first half, you're leading. The second half, they cut it to six. Did their depth just kind of wear down, like on on your not, I guess, not as deep depth as the half played Yeah, out? yeah. Um, but but you have to give them credit. Like they didn't just have extra players playing. They had ex they had guys who came in the game with tremendous intensity. Like the guys who came in the game for them appeared to be jumping on a train or a bus that was already moving and just come in like poof, like this full speed intensity um, and I, I said that uh, before the game like if if you had a, uh, if you were at a coaching clinic and you had somebody from another planet Mars so you know like what is this that coaches talk about like wanting their teams to play hard you know what is this intensity what do they mean by giving great effort you would want to put a, a, a DVD on and say, okay, hold on just a second. Let me, let me show you. Put the D and say, just, just watch Florida State. That, that's what we mean by that. that that'll wear your guys down. Now, if they, if, they, if they just played extra guys that came in and their intensity level dropped off, then we might have been able to, you know, have a chance. How much did you think, you know, the, uh, before the technical foul, you guys were still in, in range? Well, the problem was with that one, I think they had come off a situation where they made a couple free throws. And then we were set to get the ball back, and then they made you know, the technical foul, so they make two more free throws, and then I think they scored on the next possession. So mentally, you're again, you're at that time where you're, you're, you're uncomfortable. And I think that's what they did just in general, is they just, they play so hard, they make you uncomfortable. if, if we're trying to get across to our guys. If you have to be comfortable being uncomfortable, if not, then you're 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 going to be just upset, you know, ticked off for your comfort, and then you can't fight back through those situations. We did a couple of times, but that one we 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 didn't. And in, in addition to that, then there was a, you know we didn't have him to, to to rotate him in. He was in foul trouble the first half, and then that happened, so he was played seven minutes. It's another body. We we played a guy 27 minutes today that played three total minutes last season. And, and he, he, he gave us great effort, you know, but that's, you're going, that's what I mean about outside of your comfort zone. If you play three minutes total the whole season and now you come in and, and you're, you have to, you're called on to play 27 minutes and that's most he's ever played in a basketball game, I think, at least, you know, in his college career. Coach, you saw him on film. Well, what he, when he sets the, the bar for their, their defense and the pressure and the intensity uh, for it, like he, he, he's every single solitary possession, he's down in the stance and he's alert and willing to do that. Now, our guy, you know, is pretty quick and, and people don't usually try to do that for a whole game with him. And he did not look uncomfortable doing that at all. You know, um, uh, and then what, what are the other guys going to do? I mean, uh, you have to play hard. Now, I, I think having said that, I think, you know, the other guys are going to play hard anyway. But, but um, when you have a guy that has that kind of poise, um, 
while in the middle of playing with that effort? Because that's the other thing, you, you know, you're asking guys to play extremely hard with tremendous effort. Sometimes poise goes out the window. You, you know, the guy's going, you know, yeah, he's, he's, he's going as hard as he can, but his, you know, his decisions are all out of order, but he didn't, he didn't, do, he doesn't do that. Anything else? Thanks, Coach.